Well, the Marvel Cinematic Universe just got a whole lot smaller and manages to make Thomas the Tank Engine look like a badass. Ant-Man starring Paul Rudd, Eveline Lilly, Corey Stoll, Michael Penner and Michael Douglas. This is clearly not the Ant-Man from the comics but it still manages to tie into the story of this movie and that it's trying to tell. And it's interesting though how it links to the Marvel Cinematic Universe after the events of Age of Ultron. And you see that a certain organisation is still in business. And you see more or less how it got restarted. The casting is amazing in this movie as well as everyone puts in a solid performance. And who would have thought we, that we would ever get Michael Douglas in a Marvel movie? The one strength this movie has going for it though is that it does understand that it's a smaller movie than the Avengers ones and doesn't need to knock you over the head with references to all the others and just does it very subtly similar to that of the Winter Soldier. However, it does take a while to get going and set the movie on its path but once it does, it really picks up and doesn't let go. And make sure you stay for both post credit scenes as the last one is very important to where Phase 3 will be going. And my final verdict on this is an 8.5 out of 10. Thanks as always for watching this guys and feel free to comment below and tell me your thoughts on Ant-Man. And if you're new to my channel feel free to click that subscribe button. I make new videos as often as I can. And as always, I shall see you all on the next one, and take care.